guys, what's up? Ryan Necker here, and welcome back to whatever this setup is. Have you ever been so scared that you wanted to leave your own body? I have, as you just saw. I just got up and left my own goddamn body. Why am I asking that, you may be wondering? Well, I'm doing a tag video, and it's called the Scariest Thing Tag. I kind of wish the name was a little bit catchier, but whatever. So there are seven questions in total. First question, scariest real life experience had to have been when I was younger. I woke up in the middle of the night to hearing someone jingling and playing with our doorknob. It sounded like someone was trying to break in and that freaked me out for the longest time. Now my dad woke up and checked and there was no one outside so maybe I was half asleep or not. But that really scared the shit out of me as a child for a long time. Scariest paranormal experience? I would have to say before I lived at the house that I currently live at, when I was younger, we lived at a house that apparently, the people that lived there before, the husband had committed suicide in the basement or some family member had, and then a few weeks later, the wife or the mother, I don't remember which family members it was, but there's two of them, one committed suicide and one died naturally in the house. And at night, sometimes I'd hear piano music coming from down in the basement where it happened at. And that was, that was fucking terrifying. Have you ever known anyone convicted of a violent crime? Well, seeing as my past of drug usage, which if you're new to this, I am sitting at, I think, three something, maybe four years clean of heroin. So, the people that I used to hang out with, yeah, I know a bunch of people that's committed violent crimes. Are you afraid of the dark? Why or why not? I am not afraid of the dark, I quite enjoy the dark in the sense that once my eyes get adjusted to it, I can see what's around me and who's moving around. I feel like if I was ever out in the woods and someone was trying to kill me, I think darkness would be a better protection than being in a lit house. But I would prefer to be out in the dark, because I feel safer out there. Does your hometown have any scary stories or legends? Well, we do have a library here in town that used to be an old hotel. That's a claim to be haunted. I'm not really sure the backstory. Um, we do have a cemetery that is off on the edge of town. Um, I believe everyone calls it like the slave cemetery. It's from way back in time. But that little section of town, I'm pretty sure, is haunted beyond belief. What is my favorite urban legend? I think maybe the idea of the Jersey Devil has to be my favorite urban legend. My scariest nightmare. I have had many of those. Um, I do not have time to describe them all whatsoever. Um, as a child, one of the nightmares I used to have that always was repeating was... I would wake up and everyone would have been moved out of the house and I was the only one there and everyone forgot about me. For the past couple of years I haven't really had any reoccurring nightmares, but I do just have really freaky ass dreams. A reoccurring nightmare that I used to have was um, Jesse and James from Team Rocket and Barbie would pull up in a pink Cadillac while I'm on a bridge and push me off. That always freaked me out and made me very afraid of bridges for the longest time. Those were the questions, there wasn't that many, but this was the scariest thing tag. And the whole fun part about these tag videos is you can tag someone else that you'd really like to see do it or you think might do it. I tag Shy Shiloh and Tristan from Anarchy666. Why the channel's named that, I have no idea. But I tag you guys to do this tag video and answer the same questions I asked. Now you guys can do it together, or separate since it is the same channel, but I tag you guys to do it. But for now, I am Ryan Necra, and this was the scariest thing tag. Um, I'll feel you later, unless I die first. <laughs>